Hello queens and kings, my name is Tendega Shabangu, welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back. Today we are on part two for our beaded apron. We're going to be continuing, so let's get started. So this is where we left off last time previously so we ended up at this corner so what's interesting about this pattern is that it doesn't have a frame around it is it a frame or is it a border a frame around it so when you turn every time when you turn you have to turn with four beads Usually, you would maybe pick up the first two beads will be black and then you add different colors. But this case is different. We have to have four beads. Ne? So, when you pick up the four beads when you turn, the first bead is going to be the color of the previous line. Can I call it a line? And then you pick up a black. And then the remaining two beads are going to be the color of the next, the following line. So the first bead is going to be the color of the line, the previous line that you're from, which is red. That's why I picked up red. And then black. Black is a constant. Black divides our colors. And then the remaining two beads are going to be the color of the following line, which is blue, our light blue. So in total, I have four beads. Take my needle, I insert it into the central bead, and then I pull. So it's like this. So can you see the red line? It's, it's not stopped by a frame. The blue line continues the way it was. And then, remember my job is to expand the line, make sure the lines are going in the right directions. So now that I'm done with the corner, I get back to picking up three beads. So I'm going to pick up one black and two yellow i take my needle and i insert it into that one the first white bead did i say yellow i just heard myself saying yellow one black and two white and then our next color, our next line is a yellow line. So we're going to pick up one black and two yellow. The same way we did with our white. We pick up one black and two yellow. Insert into the central bead and then you pull. I do the same thing. Our next color is blue. So what do we do? We pick up one black and two blue. This blue is different from this, this blue. This is a darker blue. This is more like a powder blue. This one is a serious blue. <laughs> it's a baby blue, serious blue, powder blue. <laughs> one black and two blue. I take my needle and I insert it into the first blue bead. Let me just sort out the lighting there. The first blue bead, that is where I'm going to insert my needle. The first, let me say the first color bead. So I'm going to do the same with the green and the light blue and then i'll come back when we add the diamond part so i pushed until i got to the point so now we add our diamond 
how do you know when it's time when you have reached the diamond if you look at our white this is the only color this is the only white that makes a v previously we only have lines they're not joining but these two lines are joining and we have a v that's how you see that wait i have reached the diamond part that means i have to change the way i do things so now our aim is to expand our diamond what we're going to do we're going to pick up one black and two white beads one black and two white beads take your needle insert it here into that first white bead which is the central bead pull it nicely and then because you have the diamond still you are still expanding you're still expanding your diamond so what you're going to do you're going to pick up three white beads three white beads <laughs> three white beads and then you take your needle you insert it into that last white bead and then you pull the song has been in my head the whole day i think i have to listen to it it's a song by Gregory Porter. Na, 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 so now I have to expand the diamond. Two white and one black. Remember here, we say it's one black and two white because you are doing this side. When you're on the other side, the game changes. It's two white and one black. You're expanding. So... Imagine if we had one black and two white. Let's just imagine. You see, our diamond will have this black dot in between, which is not okay. So that's why every time you have to go back and look, am I still on the right track? So with two white, one black, when it's seated like this, the diamond oh sorry this black is going to bend it's going to make follow this black part so i take my needle i insert it on top or in <laughs> the first line that comes after the diamond which is our green so on that last green bead remember before the diamond we were inserting our needle into the first color bead so now it's the last color bead here we used to say one black two color the game changes when you get to the other side it's sort of like inverts itself so now it's going to be two color one black two color one black so it's going to be two green and one black. Oopsie daisy. I take my needle and I insert it into the last color bead. Before we used to insert it on into the first color bead. Now it's on the last color bead. Dun, da, da, da. <laughs> now we pick up two yellow, one black, which is two color, one black. Take our needle, insert it into the last color bead, that blue. Then I pull. I'm going to do the same until I get to. Okay, let me do one more. So now. I'll pick up two blue and one black. 
two blue and one black. Take your needle, insert it into the last color bead, which is the last white bead, and then you pull. And then you do the same, two white, one black, two red, one black, two blue, one black. Then we'll come, we'll talk what we get here. <laughs> and I'm back <laughs> to my, the last, 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 the last line, the yellow line. So let me just flip it nicely. I like working from my right to left. It all depends on anyone's preference. So now we're at the corner. We're starting a new line. Some people might say we are turning. Hold on, we're turning. <laughs> Yo, there are people. There are, there are people driving that are called bambezela siatiga. That means hold on, we're turning. When they turn, mm, 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 you have to hold on to your seat. You hold on. You hold on to your heart. You see yourself holding <laughs> your chest like this. <laughs> That's how the driving is so bad. Okay, so we have to have four beads in total. The, the Remember the rule that we did at the beginning of the video? The first bead will be the color of your previous line, which is the yellow. Let me say the color that of the line that is close to the end, which is the yellow. And then one black. And then the two remaining colors will be the color of the following line, which is blue in this case. So yellow, black, and two blue. Take my needle, insert it into yes, that lighting. It was just like <laughs> Insert it into the central bead or the first bead. Remember how the game changes. It's either you... How can I explain it nicely? It's going to be your one black, two color. No? So it's going to be one black, two color. So one black and two red in this case. And you insert your needle into the first color bead, which is red. So one black, two color, which is in this case is going to be one black, two white. One black, two white. You take your needle. You insert it into the first color bead. And then you pull. So you do that. Or when you're on the, the other half of the diamond, it's going to be one black, two color. One black, two color. And you're inserting your needle into the first color bead. The first color bead. I'll come back until we get to the diamonds. Oopsie. So we're at this point. Back to our diamond. <laughs> one black, two white. We pick up one black, two white. Take your needle, insert it into the first bead, the first color bead. That, the first bead that is just not black. That's the one. And then I pick up three beads, three white beads. I take my needle and I insert it into the central bead. 
This song, this song, this song. It's been in my head, yo. Sorry that I had to ring your doorbell someday, yo. That's something bothering me, yo. <laughs> Three white beads. Take your needle, insert it into the last bead. Remember when the, the part when you reach the other end of your diamond, it's a the game changes. It's no more one black, two color. It's now two color, one black. Okay, let's finish our diamond. We pick up two white and one black. I love Gregory Porter. Insert into that last color bead. So when you're on, when you're on the other side, it's two color, one black, and you insert it into the last color bead when you are on the other side it's going to be one black two color you insert it into the first color bead in that's what that's what we're going to be doing throughout this pattern and expanding our diamond so it's two color one black inserted into the last color bead let me say then the last next color bead to be precise. You know, it has been my ultimate dream to go to Cape Town Jazz Festival. Two green, one black. And I want to take my Mahara with me. I'm just I'm just hoping that after this the Rona <laughs> after the Rona is gone. Hopefully, they will be able to pick up where they left off and make more shows. Two color, one black. So I'm going to do the same until I get to the end. So I've pushed until we got to the end. So now I'm just going to flip it. I enjoy flipping it. <laughs> okay, so we're at the corner. Remember the rules is going to be the first color. The first bead is going to be the color of the line that is closest to the end, which is this color. One black. And the remaining two beads are going to be the color of your following line. I take my needle, insert it into the bead. I want to take both my parents, my mom and my dad. But you know what? I know. I know. I know them. They're those, you know those people when you take for, for take them when they are when they on vacation and they prefer sleeping instead of going out and exploring <laughs> the place. One black, two color. You do it. Yeah. The first color bead so on this side it's one black two color and you insert your needle into the first color bead we'll meet here i'll be back we'll meet here finally here now we are attacking the diamond one black two white take your needle insert it into that first bead color bead Remember, we're we'll continuing with our diamond, so we'll just be picking up white beads. Three white beads. Take your needle, you insert it into the central bead, then you pull. If maybe you'd like to, you know, when you insert it, introduce this is a side note, by the way. When you have a diamond inside of a diamond, maybe make a mini diamond. You're going to pick up one white. See, we have three. You're going to pick up one white and the color of the and the diamond, that mini diamond, and then one white. When you add this point, because you don't want a skew diamond, your point they have to be 
is the same row like this. We don't want skewed diamonds here. We want the right ones. <laughs> then three white beads. So I am going to take them to Cape Town Jazz Festival. But I'll be prepared that they will not be going to the performances and stuff. They'll probably go maybe for on the probably go because usually it's a uh, it goes on for the weekend from Friday until Sunday, if I remember correctly. I've never been there from what I've seen on Afro Cafe. Two white, one black. You remember the game changes? Two color, one black on top of in into the last color bead. But it's, it's very sad that most of the artists that I would have loved to see them performing live have passed on two green, one black. He inserts it here. Oh, Huma Sigela. I really wanted to see Huma Sigela, Miriam Makeba, a Oliver Mtukuti. I also would have loved to see Ray Piri. I would have loved Pelaye. I've seen two yellow, one black. His dance moves. <laughs> so I wonder how he, he would perform live, you know. I've seen his live performances, but being there is a different experience. So I've always wanted to experience that. So unfortunately, yeah. Also, Mama Busim Shong or Yay. Two blue, one black. But a lot of artists they still around that I also like. Tandy Summers Y. Simpiwe Nam. So the soil. Yeah. That's me. That's my music. But I don't choose. I don't be like, ah, I like. I've, I've also, I would also love, love, love to listen to Asanda Mkriki live. Yo. Her voice is everything. Okay, so this is where we're going to stop for today. Two red and one black. This is where we're going to stop. It's like this. So we pushed, eh? Can you see our diamond? So our aim is to get our diamonds to the ends like this. And then it will be a good thing. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching Queens and Kings. I love you guys so much. Remember to respect yourself. To love yourself to and have fun and to have fun that is, that one is very vital see you if you love the content that you're seeing please consider subscribing see you on the next video the part three bye